Tell us a little bit about what we're going to do now. As I told you before, we have some more varieties, but we are kind of sold out right now. Mm -hmm. uh, so today we're going to taste uh, the four of them. Mm -hmm. uh, we have a Sauvignon Blanc, we have a Syrah, a Cabernet Franc, and a Malbec. Mm -hmm. Does it sound good? It sounds so excited and I can't wait. Okay, so let's go. <laughs> Sauvignon Blanc first, Okay. Good. right? Great. Tell us a little bit about this Sauvignon Blanc. Uh, this is the 2017 vintage. Mm -hmm. uh, in Ginto, when we're making this Sauvignon Blanc, we prefer to make what we call a, a cold maceration before mm -hmm. starting fermenting. We start uh, fermenting at 15 degrees Celsius. Uh, after that, fermentation takes like three weeks in general. Three weeks? Yeah. Okay. Uh, and by the end, it will be just like the Roussan we had inside, you know, it will be a kind of cloudy. Uh, and we will move the wine to uh, stainless steel barrels. So we age the wine in stainless steel barrels, uh, stirring the lees once a week in general, so we can have a better palate mm -hmm. uh, and a more profound taste of sewing wine. It's nice. It sounds really nice. Oh, okay. So and I actually, well, this is the one of the main uh, the main wine uh, still in Casablanca, right? It's the main wine still. variety and it's also the largest uh, production area in the valley. So still the biggest, right? Yep. Mm -hmm. Yep, for sure. Cheers. We're going to describe it for you guys. I know that you would like to be here. So that's why if you would like to be here, please contact her. When, when we have visitors here, in general, we offer three of the wines. We also have mm -hmm. some local cheese. I know that you I make love, bread. I love to she make makes bread. bread. Yeah. But I told her don't make bread because I'm on diet. Very buttery. Yep. Uh, it's, it's, it, it, it has a really good texture. Mm. And this is because we stir the leaves. Uh, so you have more, you know, uh, the palate really gets better. And uh, I love, you know, this... Uh, really nice acidity finish uh, we have the citric notes we have the what we call minerality minerality yeah. wow a lot yeah a lot a minerality lot. yeah and battery yeah now we're mm -hmm. tasting <laughs> Cabernet Franc Tonkin Cabernet Franc 2015 mm -hmm. now that we move the wine bottles to the side yep so you can see actually what what's going on in here yeah this cut Franc I like it very much it has year, year? 2015. 15. That's going from where is this one is come from? Casablanca, obviously. From it's Casablanca. all Casablanca. Everything Casablanca. Casablanca, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna try to see. I'm gonna try, yeah. Yeah. To see what we can find here. Yeah. I, oh, I, I love yeah. blueberries, right? Blueberries. Yeah. In all the expression. Oh my yeah, god. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's almost so like the uh, yeah. You you're know your wine. You're <laughs> yeah. I do. You definitely. And this earthy notes. Mm -hmm. I like it very much. I wanna you see. The color of this wine, it is quite, quite bright, it's very intense. You don't even, even imagine, you never imagine that this one, it was grow here in Casablanca. It does. Wow. Salud. Mm. Still going on. Oh my god, really amazing Cabernet Franc. Thank you. I haven't tasted that one. I haven't you have tried to this come, one You have before. to come here more frequently. Yeah, I will. This crazy woman, then it's making Cabernet Franc. No, he was making at that time Malbec. Cabernet Franc, Malbec. Cabernet Malbec. Yeah. It was like red wines from Casablanca. Wow. <laughs> she is coming here to kick. And she's still doing it. Well, Malbec. This is 2015. Uh -huh. uh, lots of uh, cherry notes. Mm -hmm. Lots of cherries. Mm. The other one it was blueberry. Yeah. This is completely cherry. Mm -hmm. But very red. You know, yeah. Like yeah. And very roses. Rich in your mouth. Yeah. You know? It's really floral. Red roses. Yeah. It's really floral. It has this kind of cool climate, you know, uh, mm -hmm. it, it really shows cool climate. So yeah, much fresher, maybe people are uh, more used to 
Argentino Malbec, mm -hmm. and they are bolder. Mm -hmm. This is a mm -hmm. much more elegant wine, much more elegant. So, why this Malbec that is being produced here in Casablanca is different to the, as you said, like Ar Argentinian style, which actually is, is quite bigger. You it's, know? it's it's why? it's it's the climate. Basically, uh, if you go to Argentina, to Mendoza, mm -hmm. uh, it's much warmer over there. Mm -hmm. uh, and so you have, in general, Malbecs over there are, are, are stronger, more muscular, maybe a little bit jammy, you know. Uh, and here we have this really cool climate. We have the cool breeze from the Pacific, so it's much colder. Uh, and what happens is that the same grape expresses itself differently. Mm -hmm. So we have a much more elegant wine, you know. There you go. Yep. And this the acidity. It. And the acidity, nice obviously, acidity. it's really nice acidity. It makes just the perfect wine mm -hmm. for food. Just the perfect wine. Yeah. Definitely a gastronomic wine. I don't know how can I explain that, but I'm very happy that uh, your evolution has been incredible. Um, you have been growing so much and you have been teaching it's really possible to make those type of wine in Chile. Your Brazilian would actually is all my respect. <laughs> the Brazilians also they, they are coming to Chile. They are no, but I think we have wine. to think outside mm -hmm. of the box, you know. Mm -hmm. uh, Chile is so I amazing. I like this one. Think outside of the box. Chile is so amazing as a country. Mm -hmm. We have so many different terroirs. Uh, we have to think differently. Mm -hmm. And we have so much to do here. So we're just beginning. Mm -hmm. Thank you very much for receiving us in your loveliest spot. Um, we know that Marcos is working right now. He is yes. building up, still building, building constantly this beautiful property um, to receive you, all of you. Yes. So look at our uh, Facebook page, our Instagram page, and the details are there. So yeah, just contact us by uh, social media. That's what works best for us. You cannot miss this spot. Loved you to have you here. I love to be here also. Saúde. Saúde. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. Salud. Gracias, guys. Thank you very much. I see you soon.